remember what it was like in school. It was boring. You sat in class, memorized as much as you could, and tried to pass a test at the end. But is that good enough? These days, school can be more interesting and effective by focusing students on work that matters. This is Project Based Learning Explained. Most adults live in a world of projects. Whether it's a job assignment, home improvement, or planning a wedding, we need to actively solve problems. But unfortunately, schoolwork looks more like this than this. Let's take a look at this project based world. Meet Claire. She was recently presented with a challenge. Her company, Super Suds, makes soap. And it was up to her to find the most earth friendly way to produce it in the future. Her boss gave her a budget and a few requirements, and it was up to her to come up with a solution. She organized and managed a team who researched the options and created materials summarizing the issues. Claire's team asked for feedback and presented their findings to the boss. Claire came out of the project looking like a rock star, and she learned a lot about green products. If you look closely, Claire's success involved critical thinking, collaboration, and communication, things that aren't often taught in traditional classrooms. The world needs more Claire's, so how do we get them? The answer is project based learning, or PBL. So why is project-based learning effective for kids? Well, first off, it improves their attitudes towards learning. It allows students to connect real-life experiences to what they are learning in class. Uh, school is also more engaging for kids because they're more active. And it also connects students with the real world uh, because they're solving problems using real-world skills. And they're also developing career interests. It's not only better for kids, it's also better for teachers too because it allows them to work more closely with students and give them more feedback. And it's just more fun for them overall because kids are uh, just more active, more engaged. Um, and I also have a quote here by John Mergendoller who is the executive director for the Buck Institute of Education. It says, research has shown that um, learning content uh, as well, or that kids learn content as well or better using PBL than with traditional instruction. It also shows that students remember what they have learned longer and are better able to use what they have learned. So I also have, I asked a few people uh, their opinion on uh, project-based learning. A couple of my friends, uh, one whose name's Ryan, uh, he believes that lectures aren't good for kids and it's better for kids to be active in the classroom. So he's, he likes the idea of project-based learning. Uh, same with my other friend named Andrew. He, uh, he, his opinion, uh, he just doesn't think it's fun for kids to hear lectures all the time. Uh, it's good for kids to learn by doing. And then another person I asked was my mom, Mary Kay, and she just said, she said project-based learning is definitely an improvement from traditional style teaching and it shows the relevance from what the students are learning and also gives a chance gives kids a chance to work with others. Um, there are many schools that have been taking action uh, using project-based learning uh, especially in the New York area and elsewhere across the US. Uh, yeah, many schools in the New York area have abandoned, have abandoned traditional style teaching. Um, so with project-based learning, kids can learn uh, the material at their own pace, and it's not as strict and demanding, and a lot of these New York schools are, that's how they're teaching, and it's really being, it's, it's proving effective, and it just lets kids work on what they're struggling with. Um, an example is the Portfolio School. It's in the New York area. Um, it mixes technology with learning activities and it gives more power to the students, more freedom, 
um, rather than all the power is with the teacher. Um, and technology is not viewed as something frightening, which I really liked uh, because technology has always been a struggle for me. Um, also, there's no homework, which gives kids time to be to be with family, with friends more, do what they want to do outside of school. Um, and also teachers are just constantly giving more feedback and it's just, it's all around more effective for kids and teachers. And also, I have a chart here that shows, uh, or it compares the traditional style teaching from project-based learning.